So I wanted to write a thriller because I enjoy thrillers. And uh, it's not like there's a shortage of thrillers in the world, but uh, I've written them in the past. And I wanted to write another one. And uh, I've found that uh, the, the ones that I enjoy the most, the ones that stick with me, have got characters uh, that are somehow uh, interesting, not just kind of generic thriller people, but um, sort of you know, interesting people like you might be able to meet in real life. I felt like just writing a book with, that was kind of a big plot book. And so uh, that's what Ream D is. Um, it's kind of plot spilling out all over the place. This one has no uh, supernatural uh, element, nothing uh, you know, except luck, maybe luck and, and, and grace. Uh, but it's got no um, uh, fantastical content whatsoever. The uh, technology is a little bit more advanced in some ways than what we've got today, but it's well within reach over the next few years. In this case, I've put a fair amount of effort into trying to develop a cast of, of characters who are interesting people, who have complicated backstories, complicated family stories, and who have a lot going on in their minds. Um, during the action-packed parts of the uh, of, of the book, so you're not just reading uh, about somebody running around and shooting, but you're uh, you're also kind of seeing what is going on in their mind uh, during all of that action. And I hope that that makes for a a, a more entertaining uh, product and and one that a lot of people will enjoy reading.